Well, uh, the next one is for Ron Kind. His name's Kind. And they say oh, he's the... pleasant ad. And they say he's the wrong kind. Ah. What's this one about, Danny? Well, this is good. And in the ad, what they do is they have a little W and a big R-O-N and then a little G. So you can see Ron. In the middle of wrong? And wrong. Ew. <laughs> oh, because you can't spell wrong without old Ron. There you go. Well, I good, gotcha. Good thing his name is not Skunt. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the next one, yeah, this is the Ron Kind one we were just talking about. Ten years ago, liberal lawyer Ron Kind was elected to Congress, and he's done almost nothing in the Congress since. <laughs> and that's a good thing, because just about everything he's tried to do has been wrong. Ron Kind voted to take the words under God out of the Pledge of Allegiance. He voted to strip the Ten Commandments from our public buildings. Ron Kind repeatedly voted for gay marriage and to force the Boy Scouts to accept homosexual leaders. <laughs> wow. <laughs> this guy's despicable. I like Ron Kind. Ron Kind. He's shaking things up. Uh, and they were basically saying he's obsessed with the gays because yeah, he's like, this is all he does. repeatedly voted. Like, repeatedly. Like one vote wasn't a good Where's the good next one? vote for like, this? Where's the next vote? I'm voting now. I'm just going to pass a hat around. <laughs> But the vote's uh, over with, sir. Don't care. Want to vote again? <laughs> They're voting on the victims' funds for 9/11. I don't go as long as the gays are, are in the Boy Scouts. I'll vote for it, please. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on sweetie. Sorry about that. Sorry. Uh, not only is the audio good, but the visuals that go along with some of this audio is great. Because when they're talking about the, you know, the gay marriage and stuff, they have like a, a rainbow disco ball hanging with a wedding cake with two grooms on it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they are the worst. They're just oh, a bunch bastards. of dopes. That's very funny. <laughs> that why is should, really funny. At this point, why should we even vote? Why vote why for any of these vote? idiots? They're all just despicable human beings. Ron that music's Kine great, too. repeatedly voted for gay marriage repeatedly. and to force the Boy Scouts to accept homosexual leaders. Or so. He even voted to let illegal aliens burn the American flag <laughs> for Congress. You can vote for that? Wow. Is there a vote for that? Yeah. I want to... Where, where is the uh, thing uh, where I pull the lever for letting illegal aliens burn the American flag? <laughs> this is... Oh, Makes God. my cake stomping look uh, not that bad, right? You know what? The bill was probably the standard bill whether you should be allowed to burn the American flag in protest. Right. And it doesn't sound as good. So you just pick a group and go, you know, it could have been anybody. But allow illegal aliens to burn the flag. Now, that sounds bad. But it could have been just anybody, you know, soldier's family. You know, it doesn't sound as bad as illegal aliens. Burn the American flag. For Congress, Ron Kind is the wrong kind. Oh, <laughs> the right kind of congressman is Paul R. Nelson. This former Marine is a father of four who Ooh, supports rah. Wisconsin values. Paul R. Nelson will work to stop illegal immigration, to end our dependence on foreign oil, to win the war on terror, How? and to defend traditional marriage. I'm Paul R. Nelson, and I approve of this message. That's a fake Paid voice, right? by Paul no. R. Nelson for Congress. I'm Paul. I'm uh, Paul. Uh, uh, treat yourself. <laughs> and I'm I, Paul Nelson. And I like sex the normal way. <laughs> I, why are you stepping on the voting booth when people <laughs> trying to vote for me? <laughs> Look, my Bible. Help yourself. Help yourself. All right. Yeah, he sounds like a Bible thumper. And Paul Nelson is a stick in the mud. Yeah. The other guy wants Sodom and Gomorrah. A bunch of men without pants running in circles. <laughs> Ron Kind rules. <laughs> he really he voted to let illegal immigrants burn the flag. Repeatedly voted for gay marriage. That's all he thinks about. And to force the Boy Scouts to take homosexuals. And that other boar. Ah, I'm traditional value. Yeah. Ah. And all of a sudden the music got nice. Went from that ominous yeah. Boy Scouts being abused music to just bling, da ding, the nice piano music. I'm a former Marine, father of four, and I like sex the normal way. <laughs> I don't know about that former Marine thing. Hoorah! Semper Fi! <laughs> Joke. And this is uh, an anti-Ron Kind. Ron Kind. Ron Kind. Ron kind. Where is this battle taking place? Because I want more of these. Wisconsin. This is with the Wisconsin battle for what? Uh, cheeseheads. 
<laughs> I'll find out. Is it governor it. or uh, Congress uh, or dog catcher? I don't know. Who <laughs> dog catcher? He probably is some real crappy position. What the hell is a dog catcher? Your, right? your, I want to be your selectman. <laughs> <laughs> selectman. Do you? <laughs> well, let's take a listen. Here it is. 60 seconds of goodness. I'm kind. With our servicemen and women facing death every day, what kind of congressman would try to gut military spending? The wrong kind. Ron kind. That's right. Congressman Ron kind is repeatedly voted to deprive our troops of the funding they need to fight for us. But Ron kind has no trouble spending your money. He would just rather spend it on sex. That's right. Instead of spending money on cancer research, Ron kind voted to spend your money to study the sex lives of Vietnamese prostitutes. Instead of spending money to study heart disease, Ron Kind spent your money to study the masturbation habits of old men. Ron Kind spent. Wow. Are you kidding me? That's this is like, this that's is like, that's a skit. This is like SNL, show. right? That's got that cannot be a real ad. You're tricking us. I swear this is absolutely real. I gotta go. Back. How do you dig go this backwards. up? They actually have this on uh, the campaign website. Oh my God! <laughs> he voted to study the masturbation habits of old men. How do you not love that? How do you not love Ron Kine? Ron Kine gets my vote. I want to move to Wisconsin just so I can vote. How do I make that happen? This Ron Kine is a go-getter. We need money for cancer. Forget it. I want to know what he's thinking while he does that. I know it's hack radio, but too bad we're not being heard in Wisconsin. We would yeah. get this guy voted in. Oh. <laughs> we to. would get all our listeners a vote for this guy. Ron, Ron Kind. Kind. We love Ron Kind. Who's the money stick in the mud? Cancer research. Ron Kind voted to spend your money to study the sex lives of Vietnamese prostitutes. Instead of spending money to study heart disease, Ron Kind spent your money to study the masturbation habits of old men. <laughs> Ron Kind spent your tax dollars to study something called the bisexual, transgendered, and two-spirited Aleutian Eskimos, whoever they are. Ron Kind even spent your tax dollars to pay teenage girls to watch watch pornographic movies with probes connected to their genitalia. <laughs> All right, come on now. Come on. Come on, there's no way. You're kidding me. What? This so would make me want to vote for Ron Kind. Oh, my God, I want him for president. This is going to make everyone remember his name. Yeah. And what he does. Wait, he's Dr. Frankenstein. Can you make a promo out of this? This needs to be a promo. How did he get away with the the, the electronically hooking up teenage girls? I'll bet you they were eighteen. Yeah, of course they were over age. And it, they were they had a signed consent form, so they're older. But they don't say that because it sounds a lot worse. If it's that, and what kind of? Please don't explain. I want people to think that he's actually this sick. You know what? I would bet you that it's one bill that was signed to do some kind of like a grant that went to a college that they perhaps then used the money to study yep. sexuality on the whole you know like like uh, not individual things like he's running around going get me to vietnam Get me some teenage girls. I got electrodes. Get me some old men. I want to know what the hell they're doing in the bathroom. You know, it's, it probably is, is separated by uh, him voting to allocate money right. to a grant to study sex. A and, and they're ch picking it apart. Who, who else wants to read the report? Oh, please get it to me immediately. Oh, I, I want the report on the old men. <laughs> <laughs> the old men? Uh, absolutely. You don't want the teen uh, yeah. well, that's hot, uh, electrodes? I want to know where she was swelling up at. <laughs> what parts of the movies did she swell? <laughs> that is awful. But she got nice and swollen. Ron Kind for president. Wow. Screw Obama. Ron Kind is going to work his way up the political ladder doing what he's doing. <laughs> he sure is. I backed it up again. It's just too of good. Of course they are. Ron Kind even spent your tax dollars to pay teenage girls to watch pornographic movies with probes connected to their genitalia. Ron Kind pays for sex, but not for soldiers. If Ron Kind had better priorities, you wouldn't be having to hear this. Ron Kind is out of touch, and soon he'll be out of Congress. 
I'm Paul R. Nelson, and I approve of this message. <laughs> Paul, Paul R. Nelson. R. Nelson. Oh, I... I'm Paul R. Nelson, and I would never do anything like that. <laughs> I'm Paul R. Nelson. I don't find teenage girls hot. <laughs> I... No probes. No probes. Ron Kind is, is running against Larry S. Flint. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I'm Ron Kind. Oh, if we get away from my cake. Oh. Uh, we need to play a Paul R. Nelson ad before we take a break. <laughs> Certainly. Because that's what we promised during this segment of the Opie and Anthony show. I'm Paul R. R. Nelson. 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 We can't want to hear the Nelson, the S again. Yeah, Nelson. Okay. I'm Paul R. Nelson. 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 He gets it under control just before it gets uh, a little crazy yeah. there. <laughs> Paid for by Fuddy Duddies for Nelson. <laughs> Fuddy Duddies. Fuddy Duddy. Baby talk, baby talk. It's a wonder you can walk. All right. Uh, my opponent, Buddy Hinton, won't <laughs> let me say my name. <laughs> Peter has to hit him. Here's another anti-Ron Kind campaign ad from Paul R. Nelson. <laughs> When Hezbollah terrorists murdered 241 Marines in Lebanon, a teenage boy from western Wisconsin enlisted in the United States Marine Corps to help fight the war on terror. Twenty-three years later, that young Marine is successful businessman Paul R. Nelson, and he's running for the United States Congress because his congressman, Ron Kind, is the wrong kind. You see, Ron Kind <laughs> refuses to secure the border against illegal aliens. Instead of deporting these illegals, Ron Kind <laughs> wants to give them amnesty and voted to print American ballots in Spanish. He voted to allow these illegals to burn the American flag during their protests. He even voted to allow convicted child molesters to immigrate to this country. Because Ron Kine won't support drilling for new American oil deposits, we're dependent for oil on Islamic fascists and nations that support terrorism. And in the war on terror, Ron Kine refuses to support the very measures needed to make sure this never happens again. Elect Not Paul R. Nelson, footage. and he'll finish the job he started 23 years ago. I'm Paul job. R. Nelson, and I approve of this message. I'm Paul R. Nelson. I'm going to join the Marines. Ooh, uh, Semper Fi, Sarge. Oh, that must have been some uh, scene with him and the drill sergeant. <laughs> Let me see your war face. Uh, I'm Paul R. Nelson. Work on it. <laughs> a jelly donut, sir. <laughs> I'm Paul R. Nelson, and there's jelly donuts in my footlocker. <laughs> I'm sorry. Who the hell said that? I'm Paul R. Nelson. <laughs> <laughs> this is my rival. This is from. This is my god. I like fighting and I hate fun. <laughs> I'm Paul R. Nelson. How <laughs> does he stink? Anyone else notice the Lord of the Rings music in the background? Yeah. Uh, <sighs> Want to hear another one? You little scumbag! I got your name! I got your ass! You want to hear another one? I'm Paul R. <laughs> Nelson. <laughs> yeah, Here please. Uh oh. This can't be good. No. <laughs> Rebecca and I'm oh, no. all right okay hold it hold it hold it let's guess what Rebecca has come on let's guess what Rebecca let's hope has. it's a disease first of all wait a minute who's um whose ad is this uh this is an anti-ron kind oh okay anti-ron kind yeah. so it See, can't I know be the for stem cell research yeah, she's sick I know the answer unfortunately I'm yeah down wait 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 she's it. sick or I'm something out. I'm out Obama! And Paul uh, <laughs> Nelson knows the cure. What? Paul and Ron Nelson. Kind made her sick by yeah. throwing poisons at her face while helping an immigrant. <laughs> I think that sounds like it. While he was burning an American flag. The toxins from the American flag he was burning. She breathed it in yes. and got very ill. Because he burns them in nurseries. <laughs> in nurseries and burns flags. <laughs> With the music. <laughs> Jesus. Find? Well, obviously she's got a disease, um, and instead of uh, voting for uh, money that would go to research to help this girl, yeah. he uh, voted to see what um, <laughs> gay guys do when the lights go out and the lard comes out of the fridge. <laughs> Two old man talking, one yelling, I prefer Ritz, I prefer it on a saltine. <laughs> oh, well, tomato, tomato, yeah. Ron Kind, percentage. <laughs> he just... 
he decided to study the grope room. <laughs> grope room. <laughs> Remember that? He decided to do a study of rest stops and the holes that are drilled in the side of the stall. <laughs> oh, oh, the piano. Oh, no. Yeah. Yeah. This isn't good. Pulling at the heartstrings. She sounds My adorable. name is Rebecca, and I'm seven. Oh. I'm learning a lot in school, oh. but there is still a lot I don't know. One day, Grandma said I was going to have a little sister. I couldn't wait to have someone to play with. Hmm. Mommy's tummy started to get bigger, and I got really excited. Today, Hope Mommy came home it. from the doctor, and now I don't have a sister anymore. Rebecca's mother had a partial birth abortion. <laughs> I'm Paul R. Nelson. I'm Paul R. Nelson. Oh. That, that's terrible. I'm sorry. Yeah, that is terrible. Wow. wow. Uh, maybe that little maybe that little sniveling snitch caused the mother to not want another one running around the house. Yeah, really. Oh, nice kid. Boy. Annoying, whining little child. It's your oh, fault, that thing. I want another one of these. Two pieces. <laughs> oh, no. I'm Paul R. Nelson. Jimmy Norton. I'm Paul R. Nelson. And I want you to have your waterhead. <laughs> I bet you when they pull it out, it was like one of those one of those marshmallowy Easter candies you pull. Out. <laughs> All right. His little feet are kicking. Come on, cut it out. I'm not done yet. <laughs> Holy. Kind actually supports this heinous procedure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As the father of four children and expecting our fifth. I understand how beautiful a life is. Ew. I'm Paul R. Nelson, <laughs> and I approve of this message. Ooh. And just elect me. Oh. I understand how beautiful a life is, unless I'm pumping a bullet into someone in <laughs> Lebanon or Beirut. <laughs> so I'm stupid. Yeah, right? right? Yeah, really. <laughs> I've killed more people than I've made. I have four children. That's seven less ears than I've severed <laughs> right. for victory trophies. I, I got an ear for each kid. <laughs> In my keepsake box. <laughs> I don't like oh. your soft approach to this one. I know, because it's you can still hear the voice, too. I'm Paul Arnelson. <laughs> I know how precious life is. That's how the Arab laughs at you. <laughs> oh, you ever see a head come apart like that? <laughs> I'm Paul Arnelson. <laughs> Arnelson, and I approve of this message. Approve. Elect me to Congress, and I will work to end the barbaric practice of partial birth abortion. Paid for by Marine Corps veteran and hockey dad, Paul Arnold. Ew, <laughs> hockey dad. dad. Boy, are they just pouring everything on top of that? Hockey, hockey dad. And guy that takes the recycling bin out to the sidewalk every Friday. <laughs> Boy, are they reaching. Hockey, hockey dad. dad. Where did that come from? Paul R. Nelson, and I'm a hockey dad. I guess Ron Kine doesn't like hockey? Uh, yeah. Former Marine and guy that always pushed the toilet seat down when he's done. <laughs> what a douche. <laughs> well, this is where I uh, think Paul R. Nelson really is a douche. He's using 9-11 footage for his own benefit in this next he spot. Is. Unfortunately, this is radio, so you can't see. But, but just picture what we all have in burnt into our yeah, uh, memory. Just picture 9-11 footage as, uh, as he goes after Ron Kine and this political ad. Marriage? <laughs> it's got to be about the gay marriage. Yeah. By two this fruits. Was paid for by Marine Corps veteran and hockey dad, Paul <laughs> Arnell, <laughs> for Congress. Really because that. they love their hockey in Wisconsin. Come on. Really pushing that hockey thing. It's awful. Yeah. It's great. He's just he's brutalizing his children to succeed <laughs> and compete already. <laughs> right. Kids won stupid skates on. It sounds like he got hit in the mouth with a puck. I'm Paul Arnelson. <laughs> I'm Paul Arnelson. And my teeth fell onto the ice when I was 13. <laughs> <laughs> like old chicklets. <laughs> And Paul R. Nelson for Congress. Look how beautiful she is. Mommy, her dress is so pretty. Oh, if anyone objects to defending marriage, may you speak now or forever hold your... Here comes Ron. I object. <laughs> is Ron kind against marriage? Ron Kind actually voted twice for the destruction of marriage. My name is Paul R. Nelson, and I approve of this message because the foundation of a family is a mom and a dad. Oh. I now pronounce you husband and wife. Mommy, can we 
trust anyone to defend marriage. Don't worry, honey. Daddy and I are voting Paul R. Nelson for Congress. Why would the kid care? How old is this kid? 45? <laughs> right. Why would the kid care? Mommy, I'm two. Can we trust anyone to defend our values? God, I hope one of uh, Paul R. Nelson's kids is gay. Oh, yes. that's now. what that's about. You're Paul now. R. Nelson is not a fan of the faggot. You're that's right basically what he's saying with a there. Hockey stick. <laughs> right. That's what he's saying in that ad. He's not a fan of the faggot. Wow. That kid stinks. What a jerk. Just make a duty and shut up. Oh, mommy. <laughs> I thought the mother came home and had an abortion. Well, oh, yeah, that, that kid's in every ad. She's every... She's, she's no, 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 that's, that's the Paul R. Nelson. Uh, it's the same it, kid. Oh, yeah, same kid. Hmm. Same kid. What happened? Hmm. Yeah. Well, that's yeah. the kid that got to live. To go down to the free clinic and get you one of those abortions. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right. Show up. We're running late. We got to take Write a Write something on his car door. Stupid Damone. <laughs> Don't vote for Damone. <laughs> I'm Paul R. Nelson. Yes, Damone was trying to get his girlfriend an abortion after he had sex with her in the pool cabana <laughs> for a very short period of time. Hey, come on, don't blow up my spot. <laughs> hey, Paul, isn't this great? It's an abortion. <laughs> hey, Paul R. Nelson, where'd you get that shirt out of the hamper? <laughs> Thought you could use some help with your math homework on such a hot day. <laughs> I'm Paul R. Nelson. Uh, oh, hey, he Rhett. Is. Well, Ron Kind, I guess, is, uh, what? Uh, he's for gay marriage. So that means he wants to destroy marriage in general. No, no, right? assistant to the assistant manager of the hockey team. <laughs> <laughs> I do. Anyone object? I do. There's only one penis in this marriage, and I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they have they have them uh, yelling out in the middle of the wedding. I do. That's great. <laughs> Brian from PA. Oh my God, I'm crying. Paul R. Nelson having a little girl talk about partial birth abortions is possibly the funniest thing I've ever heard. <laughs> this, I swear, this Wisconsin race is the best. Yeah, we're looking at other races. Though. Jersey was a great one last year, but I mean this one. Well, oh. Someone out there is using a uh, Sopranos approach, and they're using bada bing in their spot. Well, I, because of the Jersey ads uh, last year that worked so well in the Corazine uh, Forester, yeah, a little contest. Uh, the mob-based ad is really working. Yeah. So they try That's to. That's a hot one this year. With, without any connection to organized crime, they try to make the other guy seem like he's in the mob. Right. <laughs> It's hysterical. It's wonderful. These guys are got the comedy right. Guys